we present face we are a novel method for facial reenactment in virtual reality current state of the art methods for face tracking in vr are able to achieve good tracking results but their main focus lies on driving cartoon like avatars With Face VR, we focus on animating real-world stereo videos. To this end, we present a novel real-time approach for facial reenactment in VR. Using this self-reenactment, we can produce a stereoscopic video of a person without the HMD. This is a fundamental pathway for communicating in VR. We present Face VR a novel method for facial reenactment in virtual reality. We present Face VR, a novel method for facial reenactment in virtual reality. This is a virtual avatar. I'm wearing a head mounted display. To robustly track the lower part of the source actor's face, we use the Aruko AR marker to better constrain the rigid head pose. This way, we can easily track strong head motions of the source actor, as shown on the right. Here we show our eye tracking during rigid head motions. On the left, we see the input video and the extracted eye texture that is used to track the eye gaze. With our eye tracker and the reconstructed expression of the source, we reenact the target actor. On the right, we show the final reenactment output as well as the retrieved eye texture used to synthesize the eyes. Here, we evaluate the loss of information when only the lower part of a face is visible. To this end, we self-reenact the actor. The color difference on the right shows that our results are very close to the ground truth video stream, even when a significant part of the face is occluded. Here we show a comparison to state-of-the-art eye gaze and facial tracking approach of Wong et al. While our reconstructions are of similar quality, our approach additionally enables realistic re-rendering of the actor, which is of paramount importance for our reenactment scenario. Here we compare our two rendering strategies of the mouth interiors. The left output shows the approach that retrieves the mouth interior from a previously recorded mouth database, as shown in the previous video sequence. The right output shows our mouth cross-projection technique, which projects the mouth from the source actor to the target actor. We evaluate our novel stereoscopic face tracking approach using a high-quality stereo reconstruction as reference. Here we show a direct comparison to face-to-face -to -face based on our stereo camera setup. We achieve consistently lower photometric error in both views. This is essential for tracking and reenacting VR content. In contrast to face-to-face, -to -face, which does not track and transfer eye motion, we also improve the re-rendering of the mouth interior using a saliency-based image deformation technique. This leads to more temporally coherent results, as shown on the right. Our approach can be applied to arbitrary source and target actor combinations. This allows not only self-reenactment, but also gaze-aware stereo reenactment of different people in real time. For example, one can control a stereo avatar of a different person in a VR environment. Here we show a close-up of our reenactment results. On the left, we show input from both the external camera, used to track the lower part of the face, and from the internal IR camera. Our real-time approach drives the target actor on the right based on these inputs. Even eye blinks can be transferred from source to target, leading to realistic stereo re-renderings. Thank you for watching.